Today, I'm going to show you how to resaw on the bandsaw without any special tools or gadgets. Many new bandsaws will come with a very tall fence, and this is great for resawing unless you have drift, meaning the blade will want to wander to one side or the other, which is many times the case. And if so, then you need to angle your fence to compensate for that drift. You can also get the special resaw fence that secures to the base with magnets and has a single point of contact, which allows you to manually compensate for the drift while pushing through the cut. There's also some great blades out there made just for resawing, like this half inch wood slicer blade from Highland Woodworking. It leaves a very smooth surface with just a little bit of sanding can get rid of the blade marks. Today, I'm gonna show you that you don't need any of that. And all you really need is a blade with no more than four teeth per inch. If you have any more teeth than that, it's not going to remove the waste and time and it's gonna cause drifting and burning. And let me show you how I do this. I'm going to resaw this two inch board into three pieces and I'm just using my fingers and the edge of the board as a guide to draw the two lines. No fancy tools needed. Now I'm just going to freehand my board through the blade, cutting right down the middle of my pencil line. No fences and no guides, just a slow steady cut. Because I'm resawing my board in the thirds, the middle piece doesn't have a flat side, so I'll run that over my joiner. If you're resawing your board in half, this isn't necessary and you can move right on to the planer. Now I'll run all my pieces through the planer once or twice to remove the saw marks and plane them down to equal thickness. And that's all it takes. Now some of those gadgets makes the process a little bit easier, but I wanted to show you that you don't need those things to make resaw cuts. Thanks for watching. I put out new how-to project videos every Friday, so be sure to subscribe. Be safe, stay passionate, and make something.